Okay, no, it's not. Yeah, it's VK530 with the Zeus X on top. I've got the VTX100 with the Bombus on top. I've also got my Pickle Squeeze 2 with the Elder Dragon on top. And I've got the... I'm going to get the name of this wrong, as usual. The wrong... From Rinko? The mantle, Rinko, that's the, it. The, the mantle <laughs> S. Mantle S kit. Yeah. Um, Cherry Menso and that. The Wogginberry from the King's Custard and that, or the King's Cream, whatever one you want to call them. Uh, Frozen Pond, another two. And that and that. Okay. So. Yeah, I think with my opening, my sound wasn't on again. I think we had a problem again. <laughs> like every week. So here I am again. It was working on mine, so that's all that I need to know. Uh, all right, <laughs> not on mine. <laughs> um, if you want to see what's happening in all chat, please go along to, if you're on my page, to Dimmy's YouTube channel, not what his live link. If you're on Dimmy's page, come over to my YouTube and open the link, and you'll get both charts. All right. So. Dave is with me. Oh, Dave, you. And I see yes. a lot of people in your chat already. Ronnie yes. and Jules Mama Vapes. Hi, Jules. I'm going yeah. to run through the names, everybody. So, okay. we've got Vape Me TC, Jim, Wombo, um, John, as usual, Ronnie, Jules, Mama Vape. Um, Mama Vape, nice to hear Manic. you. Stereo, yeah, Garrus, Graham, yeah, so we've got quite a few in my chat yeah. this week. And in my chat, Dave and Ronnie also, he's on both chats. Ronnie, always here. You, Ronnie. I think Ron, yeah, Ronnie's on both chats. Yeah, he's always watching both channels. He's a, a real loyal fan. <laughs> <laughs> so there was one thing. What? There was one thing I forgot to do, and that was enable Nightbot. Okay. <laughs> but it's running now. So I hope everything goes well today on my channel because my computer is really uh, on the edge, <laughs> almost falling <laughs> over. So every time. As usual. Start, yeah, <laughs> but now it's really. He's really at the edge. <laughs> oh, it's too much for it, so really time for a new one. If someone wants to sponsor, <laughs> <laughs> can always try. <laughs> well, I've sent two emails today to try and get more sponsors for my channel. I didn't send any email. I don't know how to get sponsors for my channel, for the channel, or what they have to do for it. Uh, if I ask normally, if I ask them, they don't react on it, so I don't know how. Mm. Um, they could do like what Coyle is doing with me, is giving you items for giveaways. Yeah. Giveaway, That's yeah. That's one, yeah. Or like a, somebody that makes coils, give you coils to you. For you to use and show off in all your reviews, like all your RTA, RDAs. Okay. Yeah, okay. So you yeah. can show them off, you mention them, yeah, and so I'll forth. I will start looking for it. <laughs> 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 but I've got all the sponsors to for my uh, reviews, so it's it's the one thing or the other. Eh? They send me stuff to review, so I don't know if it's easy to get a uh, sponsoring for the show. Yeah, um, if they're just sending you items for review, I wouldn't class as a sponsor. Uh, no? no, no. But like small ants, uh, they send every time they send me their stuff. Every time. Uh, so doesn't matter because they're not giving you. They're not like sending three or four items at a time, so you can then give away the other ones. Yeah, well, sometimes they, they send me two two mods or something to give away, but only for the review. That's right. Yeah. yeah. Uh, St Stephen also here again. 
Hey John, Jerry. Yeah, every week the same people I see there. Yeah, oh. there's a few new ones yeah. here tonight. Oh, on DDD there's also a giveaway on uh, the Facebook page and live, so some people will hang there for a mo for a moment. Yeah. All right. And did you get any vape mail this week? Um. I think it was just the mantle esque that no, I got in. Uh, I, I think the, uh, uh, with me it's only the profile I think um, I got last week. There was uh, I can't remember if I had the King's Custard range on. Yeah. Oh, yeah. No, I got that this week, didn't I? Yeah, this week. Yeah, you yeah. posted it uh, two or three days ago. Yeah, so I've got... I'm on that at the moment. Yeah. Yeah. I've also got some lemon. Lemon? Oh, I always like lemon. lemon. Yeah. Um, That's empty. I've got some banana. Or banana. Banana. Yeah. Mm. OG custard. I'm not really a custard man. Um, you won't like the banana then, because that's banana custard. Okay. Cinnamon. Which is oh, custard as well. Really don't like cinnamon. <laughs> really don't like it. Um, and I got two rainbow, which is a cream. A creamy rainbow. Mm, that's yeah. that can be nice. So I've got what one, two, three, four, five of them still to try. I'm just going to do one ball at a time. Um, I did win them on three men and a vape show. A couple of weeks ago, um, they had the King's Custard guy on their show. It's a competition. Oh. I entered it and I won it. So it was good of them to send them all up to me. Yeah. So I'll show them off as much as I can. <laughs> there won't be a review for them because I don't do juice reviews. <laughs> Why don't you? But you will see me. Why don't you do I've juice just, reviews? Just never done it. I just try it once. Nah. I, I did it with the Empire again, Empire Brew, but I did it on my live show on Wednesday, so maybe I'm going to record an, a separate review for it, but I don't know for sure. I reviewed them on a, my Wednesday live vlog. They weren't bad, but too much mango, too much blackcurrant, not my thing. <laughs> uh, um, Vaping with TC, I don't think I can actually turn them up. They're saying you're quiet, dummy. I'm quiet oh, again. Oh, maybe. On my channel, or? That's it. It's okay, I've done it. Okay. It's on my channel. Okay. Because I think with me, it's all, it's all open. Yeah, I had to put you up a wee bit. Yeah. I don't usually have to, though. I don't know how it's on. Oh, how is it on my channel? Mm, mango and black currant, Dave. Yeah, mango and black currants. Not my thing. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe I get, do a giveaway with it. <laughs> so, uh, probably I'm going to give them away all away. So, but uh, the one from Empire uh, Brew, he uh, he wanted me to give them to my uh, Instagram crew, and they could put some pictures on it because I'm not active enough at the moment. <laughs> Uh, I'm gonna put the the profile on a mod. RDA or RTA? RTA. Uh, I received it this week. They sent it to me, to me this week, and I uh, they sent it me two: one uh, black one and one blue one. And the blue one is going to go into giveaway after the review. And the black one, I'm testing now. But they sent me a mail how to uh, how to wick it because it's not so easy to wick. Because if you wick it normally, like you wick another RTA, it runs it runs dry. Every every two or three pulls, it runs dry. So you have to cut it in a in a 45 angle degree and just put the the, the small piece into the into the slot, and then it's it would be juicing. Uh, Probably they say, but I still have to try it. Uh, yeah, and I'm not really a mesh fan, so I, I wasn't a fan of the profile RDA either. 
So I, I, I always, my, I pull too long on it, so I always run it dry after two pulls. Yeah, you're like me. <laughs> I didn't like it either. No. Use mesh. It was fine with a normal coil, but yeah. as soon as I put the mesh coil in, I didn't like it at all. No, me neither. Uh, it's yeah, I'm not a fan of the just. Um, it's too much cotton in t uh, under the mesh coil. I think it it needs it needs too much juice to to get a uh, to to yeah uh, to get it work properly. And yes. now like this one also, I'm I'm vaping it on 65 watt, but it's. Now my batteries are down. All right. <laughs> <laughs> Take another That's one. a good start to the show. Yeah. See, I made sure everything was just about topped up. I didn't have to. The only thing I forgot to do was top up my bombers. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, but me, the problem was my PC. I had to have to have my PC running before the show, so <laughs> <laughs> it's more important than. Uh, mm. Fill up all the the, the, the mods with def with a decent battery <laughs> that I can do during the show and put it on my proton. Same 65. See, almost ready dried out. <laughs> yeah. Oh man. Oh no, that's a problem. Oh, now it's uh, I can't there was something I meant had to do. What you had to do? I've not got the screen running at the back of me. Again. Oh yeah. <laughs> Again. How many times has that I forgot it? Almost every <laughs> time. <laughs> but every time something goes wrong into the show. Now the intro, <laughs> I did the intro with no sound, so <laughs> what's <laughs> every yeah. time something goes wrong. What's new? Um, oh, John only vapes custard. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, John, I don't only um, Vaptasia custard. I I like a bit, a bit. <laughs> I bet. Uh, who is? Sending me a message. Right, so that's that gone now. So I'm fine. Okay, <laughs> now everything is fine. <laughs> By VP faggot it Ubiir. Yeah, Ubiir. <laughs> that's a good one. Hmm. Now he's wicked, he's wicked nicely. I let it stand for two days and now <laughs> it looks wet enough. <laughs> um, John's saying that you haven't wicked it good. Uh, the profile. No, I haven't what? Wicked it good. Wicked it good. The yes. Yeah, I, yeah, I wicked it good, but I don't like it. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, I also got this one in. That's right, the new Hexa 2.0. It's a Hexa pot system. It's from Belgium. It's from a, a wholesale who brings it out um, from a nearby, uh, how you call it, village <laughs> here. <laughs> it's it's not far. It's 15 minutes from here, and they bring this out. And they had one, the first one, but the first one had problems with, or it runs dry, or it has a spit back. And it had a lot of problems, the first one. Now they made a new one and they said all the problems are gone. But I'm testing it now. That's already my second pot. And I'm not sure if all the problems are gone because sometimes I still got some spit back. And they made a new one and the old, the new pots don't fit at the old one. So chops get stuck with the old hexa and now they start promoting the new one. And with the old one, they said they're gonna uh, introduce a lot of new flavors, and they also introduce uh, 10 milligrams uh, in, instead of 20 milligrams. But now the second is out, and the only thing they uh, have more is two new flavors: mango and raspberry ice. And mm, mm, again, mango. Now I'm vaping mango, <laughs> so not really my thing. 
but they use closed systems don't they the pods. Yeah, yeah it's a closed system you can refill it if you pull off the back and it's uh, it's a hassle but normally it's a closed system but nah I'm not really a fan and now with the new one from uh, the tobacco company from uh, how much how it's called bat or something in the UK or it's already uh, out in shops but in Belgium it comes out uh, Monday the the closed system from the tobacco company lucky strike and they're gonna promote it in Belgium they're gonna in they're gonna put five million uh, euro in it to promote it because it's they now they say the tobacco companies vaping is less harmful than um, tobacco <laughs> smoking so they're gonna put this one out and they want to be the marked leader of a uh, with their device, but nah, <laughs> nah, I don't think so. Yeah. They're still behind uh, a bit. Now, it's better than the first one. The first one from the tobacco company is uh, Logic Pro. It was uh, the technology of two years back. So now it's, it's, uh, it's already better, but I think we're going to try to boycott it with the uh, vape shops. I don't want uh, any tobacco company products in the vape shop, so. I, I, I'm curious how, how the other shops are going to um, handle it with the new uh, device from them. It'll probably go into like wee corner shops and that. Yeah, yeah, probably, but probably if people start buying that one, they go go to ask for the new flavors uh, at the vape shops, and mm, then you can't, then you have to take it in, and I and I don't want to, so. I don't know how how it's going to work out. It's all about the money. Yep, it's all about the money. Yep. They even said it on the news. Uh, if they start the 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 guy from the tobacco company, uh, he he sa also said it. It's not about on, only about the health because he wants people stay smoking, but it's because of this going to be uh, more money for for them than cigarettes. Because cigarettes are going down. There are in Belgium there are two million people smoking cigarettes, and three hundred thousand people are vaping around that. And they think in five years it will be six hundred thousand people who vape, and uh, the smoking people will go down even more. So they they want to uh, yeah they want to jump sure. into. <laughs> <laughs> mm -hmm. They want to get the money, but they're losing. Yeah. But now already the all the professors from uh, the hospitals and everything and uh, the anti-tobacco Liga in Belgium is saying no vaping isn't better and on the long term it would be even worse and nah. So now the tobacco company is jumping on it. I don't know. It's a good thing. I think uh, the the cancer Liga and everything is going to be even more against vaping because tobacco companies are selling it. Yeah. No, don't touch anything to do with tobacco companies at all. Because yeah. over here we've got, I think it's three different pod kits that's in shops, mm -hmm. just normal shops, and I wouldn't touch any of them. No, I mean, I've got the Logic Pro, because my boss has a a, a, a normal a, a normal bookstore, and he sells it. But uh, actually, he doesn't sell it. He has it in in the shop but he never sold one because <laughs> he he's uh, he's against it also but they gave it to him he was one of the pilot uh, shops the first one to try and sell it but nah and last this weekend yesterday it was uh, the introduction in Belgium from the new pot system from the tobacco company and some shops went there so I don't know which vape shop are going to take it in the already the wholesales already called me that we we uh, shouldn't take it in, but they also think about their pocket, of course. <laughs> yeah, it saves about money. Everything. Oh. Congratulations, Ronnie! Ronnie just won the first prize on uh, the DDD uh, Facebook page. <laughs> <laughs> it was alive there, and he just won first prize. What did you win, Ronnie? You, Dave. Sorry. Yes, no. Yeah, okay. I shut up. Have you had anything else coming today or this week? 
Nah, only nah, only the profile the and the hexa, and yeah, that's all. I think. Uh, wait, I did. Oh yeah, and I did the rebirth RDA, but I made a big mistake on the rebirth RDA. <laughs> Why? What did you do? I didn't watch any reviews, and I just and I I, I don't like the rebirth for sing uh, for double coil. So I builded it in my review single coil, and I presented it as a single coil and not as a dual coil. Because I hate to build a dual coil, <laughs> but yeah. Well, my this X for the review which I've done yesterday for it, I've done single coil because I prefer it single rather than dual. Yeah. And ninety nine percent of all other reviewers have done it in dual, so I've done it single. Uh, I don't have it. <laughs> the. I don't like the, the the first two Zeus RTAs. Um, did yes. I? No, I don't think I did. No. And I don't. No. I I've got the first two, uh, the the single and the dual coil Zeus, but I don't like them. It's not my thing. Jules, this is open. Jules, I don't know if I'm going to the UK uh, Expo. I, I don't know. It's it's. Uh, a pretty strange time at the moment and I don't know if I can go to the expo it, it, it depends if my boss will <laughs> pay for it or not so I don't know yet maybe in at the, at the last minute I will book <coughs> and I will come but I, I, I'm looking even I'm, I'm, I'm even looking for a, a ticket to buy it on my own so the cheapest ticket I found was 200 euro to go to the to Birmingham and back so maybe I come on my own I don't know yet but I still have to book a hotel and everything, so it will be last <laughs> minute. <laughs> so I don't as know. As usual. Yet. Yeah, as usual. Yeah. <laughs> as you, it's also always like that. Even when when I went to China last year, it was last week. The last week we booked everything. So. Uh. I don't know. At the end of this month, I may be booking my hotel for October Expo. Oh no! <laughs> I'm not so organized. Everything last. <laughs> uh, everything goes last minute. No. Still got batteries. Yep. I'm gonna vape on my RDA. It's gonna. Take it's like for me. I booked my hotel when I come back from the yeah. expo. Yeah, in October. No, but, but you book it yourself, and I have to count on my bus to pay for it. And uh, it wasn't such a good half year, so. <laughs> <laughs> no, you just have to keep pushing them on. Yeah, yeah, and Jules, of course. If you, if I come, we're going to chat again. Of course, I, I liked your the chat last time. Uh, oh, another set of calls. Oh, Thierry's uh, also there. John, it's about the same. The flavor's about the same. It has a wee bit more muted, but there's not much between the single and the dual, because obviously there's more area inside the chamber not getting used with coils so there's more air getting into it which makes it that wee bit muted but it's not much mm. yeah it's, it's also the same with me with the, with the wasp nano rta i'm using it now at 21 watts with uh mount a long coil in it um six zero point sixty six ohm and with the airflow almost fully closed then I like it I, I'm not such a fan of the the new wasp with the air uh, with a normal coil in it and on direct to long I'm, I'm, I'm still finding out how how I can put the coil to get the most of the flavor and with the mount along it gets enough flavor it vapes nice I'm, I'm using it in mount along at the moment and mm, strange thing this Wasp Nano. I've not got that. I don't think I'll get it. Uh, I, I had four of them, so I already gave two away. <laughs> Still got one to give away. Well, I only need one item to review for Expo, the week of Expo. Oh, yeah. So Expo will be like Friday, Saturday, Sunday. I need one for to go up on the Wednesday. And then that'll be me, because obviously I'll get stuff on my Expo for the week after. Oh yeah. 
Oh, I, I don't have to, that much anymore. I still have to review the piece, the Peacemaker XL RD, RTA, and then the profile and the hexa, and I think that's it. I think. <laughs> so I don't have a lot of stuff anymore. But yeah, the the Cube Mini is on its way. So that's the only thing I know. It's on its way, and Kais promised me they would send me their la latest stuff, but still haven't got anything. And I still haven't got the time to uh, send them a message. So next week I really have to send some WeChats and everything. <coughs> but, <laughs> and also with my with my uh, phone numbers changed, I sh I have to contact them also. <laughs> when I contact them for my phone number, I I start asking them to send me stuff. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Bag bagging again. <laughs> Now yesterday I hammered through all my reviews, everything I'd been testing for the last week, two mm -hmm. weeks actually, because um, I got the review done for this. Oh yeah, the Essex Mini, uh, the Essex uh, pod system. My class pod. Mm -hmm. It's going up on tomorrow night, it'll go live on YouTube, and it's going you, early. And what do you think of it? Of crap. The, uh, crap? <laughs> <laughs> I, the I, mod's good. Yeah? I the mod is good. The pods are crap. They need to change the coils that's in them. I reckon. Uh, uh, yeah, I also heard two things about it. Some people liked it and a lot of people don't like it. So, I think it looks good, but... <laughs> looks aren't anything. Uh, yeah. Everything, of course. Uh, the back so, would make more better people They need to change the pods so they're better. Yeah. Oh, you're getting better flavor for them. Um, I also got the Bombus review done, and the VTX 100 done, and I got my Z6 done. All right, you worked hard. <laughs> so that's me. I reckon maybe three weeks ahead of myself for reviews getting posted up. Uh, I really have to start. Um, um, f f f recording some new reviews. I, I, I it, it, I don't know what it is, but I can't get myself started up again. To I, I only do my live shows at the moment, and it's it's yeah, it's hard to get a review done. <laughs> it's, I, 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 yeah, I did uh, the rebirth, and it was <laughs> yeah, not such a good one. So I have to concentrate more. <laughs> yeah. Thanks, Jules. Um, I'm going to go into the chat see what's happening. Uh, just ordered the Peacemaker 25 millimeter single coil by Squid Industries. Yeah. yeah, I only got the XL. I don't have the 25 single coil. And I, I th I'm not. I, I vape a lot of single coil lately because it comes out a lot of single coil things. But I'm not such a single coil vapor. I'm, I like my vapes around 100 watts between 80 and 100 watts it's more my thing so dual coil more my thing like my RDA <laughs> Jim's saying a 0 0.5 fuse quarton is perfect for the wasp zero point, yeah it's from from around 0 0.5 and higher I think it's good on the wasp <laughs> nano if you've got a they, 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 uh, they provide a, a 0 0.2 coil with it but uh, I don't like it I've got it yeah, I've got it here. I think, do I've got batteries in it? Yeah, batteries in it. I've got the 0 0.2 coil from from uh, Umir theirself, but they didn't put um, on the package which coil it was again. Told them several times, but they still provide a coil without telling what kind of coil it is, and I really don't like that. Yeah, near the I prefer when you put a wee sticker on telling you what the coil is, what's made of, and the ohms. Yeah, right. Especially the the the, the, the what's made, what, what it's made of. That's Im the most important, I think. Just yeah. I, I, I never use the coils that come in and anyway. I just weave them. Use the same coil, so I'm getting the same results. Uh, I'm uh, most of the time I use the coil provided to see what it what it does with the coil provided and I and uh, afterwards I put in a, another coil to see how it works with that and 
the coil that's provided and I, I don't like it with the wasp so I think they, they should provide another coil with it Alright. Yeah. Now I was <coughs> test with the same coil that way you can what the flavour should be it's different with something like that where it's a stock coil obviously you can't yeah. do that no. so you can only go by your own uh, uh, before I always tested with the same juice with uh, Harambe but I stopped vaping Harambe at the moment so now I'm testing with the cold brew macchiato <laughs> because I, I know how that needs to needs to taste yeah that's why I usually use my frozen pond to taste everything because I came out it should taste like yeah. Um, I just put the wrong juice on this tonight when I <laughs> was pulling it. That's where it's got cherimento on it. But once the cherimento is finished, I'll put the frozen pond in. This one, the, the macchiato, is the first juice I like with some um, ice in it. It's an iced coffee and it's got a, an icy feeling in the throat when you inhale it. And it's the first juice I like with some cold in it so uh, uh, I don't like uh, my fresh juice or menthol or uh, especially menthol I don't like menthol no, I don't mind menthol no. the, the taste of menthol nah not my thing okay. JJR is asking when your RDA is out they say it will be re revealed the 7th of April in Manila and they still uh, it's already a week they saying it's it's going to be revealed then but there's they're still um it's going to they wanted to to bring it out in three colors and black and stainless is already uh everything okay but they want uh, i wanted it, it in a pink pinkish gold and they made it the first time in pink gold but the color was more uh an washed off bronze so it wasn't very nice so they started to pro all the process over to get it the right color and that's why it's um, delayed for uh, almost a month now because yeah they want to try to get the pink color right yeah first they said they gotta bring it out without only in two colors and a few days later they said they started again on the pink color so they they also really want the pink so <laughs> I hope it's it won't take too long anymore because uh, it's getting on my nerves. <laughs> it, it takes too long. It's almost now a year and a half I'm working on the RDA and uh, it's time it comes out. <laughs> Not only for the RDA, I really want, I need need, need the money too. <laughs> <laughs> yes, Jules, I should say in case you have allergies with coils with your RDAs, yeah. RTAs. Yeah, that's right. Mm. I don't like the cantal so and I, I only vape actually I only vape nichrome 80 I don't like cantal and I don't like stainless either so <laughs> <laughs> yeah difficult person <laughs> yeah AFC we moved it to a Sunday so Dummy can spend time with his kids on a Friday night yep. and that's why it's moved to the Sunday and that's why I now do my vlogs on the Friday night Oh my! You, Runny won three liquids, a, a cap, and a set of coils. That's a nice prize. Oh yeah, I ha I needed to do the giveaway on Wednesday and I forgot. <laughs> yeah. Oh man. I'm I'm doing so bad at the moment. <laughs> I forget everything. Right, damn it, AFC's asking, do you know who will stock it in the UK? Who will stock? Not not yet. Nah, that's uh, also the thing. Um, I have to see what uh, wholesale it will will sell it in Belgium and Umir and uh, the company does the rest. Yeah, now you know. <laughs> and, <laughs> and they do and they do the rest. So I don't know yet. So it's all for me. It's all one mystery. So they don't they don't tell me a lot actually. They only say when they probably gonna bring it out, and they only say what they are doing at the moment. But 
if I ask for a price, or if I ask for a wholesale, or if I ask how many they're going to bring out, they never answer. They always say, oh, we will see, we will see, we will see how the first orders will be. <laughs> so, don't know yet. But we, we're going we, to we're gonna reveal it and then promote it for two weeks before we bring it out. And then we're going to see how much uh, demand is, it, it there is. And then then we know how much ho the which wholesale we're going to sell it and everything. And from the minute I know a thing more, I will tell. <laughs> everything I know, you know. All vapes in stainless. Oh, John likes stainless. Mm. Yeah, I don't. I prefer N I eight. Yeah, me me too. <clears throat> Benny Barrett. Yeah, the bulk RTA. Yeah, that's the same thing from Omir. And I, I don't understand. They're gonna bring out two things or just one or I don't understand. I don't know how they're gonna do it. I will see. They may do both at the same time. Yeah, maybe. I, I don't know. It's Oh, GD is also there. Nice. <laughs> All right. Well, for the rest, I don't have a lot to say actually. Uh, what did I? What did I do this week? Um, I've not done nothing. No, me neither. I just worked in the shop, <laughs> and it was. A I have. I've just been sitting here. Oh, I did get my three D printer working. Oh yeah, right. The one that's sitting just there. And did the printer work out fine? <laughs> well, I printed this off. Oh yeah, yeah, the battery holder. But it's weak down the bottom. I oh, don't know yeah. if you're able to see it. Yeah. Just there, you can see the crack. Yeah. Okay. Um, so I'm going to have to put the two strips down the side, like... This one here. I don't know if you can see it, but I've got yeah. two strips running yeah. down there. Makes so I'm going to have to add them on to add some strength down at the bottom. Yeah, it makes yeah. it a little bit stronger. That took 12 hours to print. <laughs> 12 hours. All 12 right. hours. Alright. <clears throat> it's a wee bit noisy because it's just sitting straight on the worktop, so I had to go away and buy a rubber mat for it. <laughs> which came yesterday, and I've stopped to put it underneath it. So once I get time to put it underneath it, I'll get the other one designed and printed. Yeah. But I'm also going to do another bit that I can put on top of it so yeah. I can have even more because this only holds see the 18 or 20 batteries oh yeah you want more <laughs> and I want more <laughs> oh, okay um, <laughs> so I've got that to design as well okay. it's just a okay, case so you get the, get the 3D image cut off from about here where it goes down yeah. and then just put wee whips down well, I'll be down the bottom, yeah. so it just sits on top of it and can't move. Okay. So I've got all that to do. All right. Yeah, I, I'm I'm uh, <coughs> recharging my batteries at the moment. It was time. <laughs> it's all I always use all my batteries, and when they're <laughs> almost all gone, then I start charging them again. Oh. Well, I've still got my 20 new batteries sitting here to get charged. <laughs> I still haven't had time to do it. Yeah, I really need to get some new batteries because all my batteries are running uh, a bit too old. Um, the ones I'm using now are about two year old. They're yeah, mine too. All, all my batteries are about two years old and I've got some problems with it. So after one hour, two hours, they're all flat. So. Oh no, I'm still getting my full day out of a dual battery setup. Out of the batteries. Okay. So my batteries are still not too bad. No, mine are. Um, I need a new 26650 
because one of them's dead. Yeah, I've got a lot it's of. Not getting used that much, eh, so. I've got a lot of 18650s or 50s or <clears throat> who are starting to get, uh, yeah, dead. <laughs> so, it's it's uh, mm. MI 21700s are all dead because I put them into a. Uh, wait, where is it? Where is it? Is it? Where is it? Where is it? Oh. I put it into the Wismic from Jabo. Um, what one is it? The Rillo uh, RX uh, 2 21700. And every time I put some batteries in it and I let them in there for two hours, batteries are dead. And it's a new mod. Yeah. So, yeah. Mine is okay. No, nah, this one, every time I put batteries in it and I leave them in for two hours, the battery is dead. And even with a with a device turned off, so I I, I don't I don't put batteries in it anymore. Because <laughs> I left my dual twenty one seven hundreds in mine yeah. for a good two months at least, yeah. and I never stole full of charge, but I went to them because uh, I wonder where all my batteries were, and that's where they were. <laughs> it's probably something with the mod or the chip or something, but it's yeah, it it it, it, it drains the batteries fully down. So, if I put them into a, a charger, a charger it says one amp or so, and yeah, battery's dead. Doesn't work yeah. anymore. So really, That's it's not good. nah. So I never use it anymore. So now all my twenty one seven hundreds are dead. Need new ones also. <laughs> but I'd, I'm gonna <laughs> buy. A, a, I'm gonna take the forty T's or the thirty T from uh, Samsung this time. Not I, I enjoy use um, 18650s is 30 Q's. Yeah. 21700s are trust files. Never, yeah. Yeah. Um, who was that? Said Mitch said that they were actually pretty good. They don't go up to 40 amp, they're about 30 amp. Yeah. But how I vape, it it I never had that. Matter. Anyway. No, that doesn't matter. <laughs> but I use um, 26650. I've got one MNKE left. Yeah. No, I've got. Yeah. Uh, I don't. I they're don't, old. That's about three year old or more. I, I don't and think it's still I. Going strong. I don't think I have one of them. <laughs> <laughs> no. Um. I'm positive it's I draw his own. 26650s that's in the works. Uh, they just live there. Um, uh, I, I always use uh, iJoy normally for uh, 21700 or 202700s, 20, but <coughs> mm, I, I'm going to try the to, to 30T and the 40T from Samsung next time. They, they sh they, uh, uh, somebody in the shop told me they're really good batteries and they got a good battery life, so gonna try to start using those. Well I'm saying I'll be getting myself a new charger. Just so I can charge quicker. <laughs> yeah I charge at uh, always charge at 0 0.5 never fast. Oh no yeah. I'm always 2 amp. Nah never never because uh, if I want to charge at 2 amp I only can charge 2 batteries at once so yeah, yeah, it's the same with me. Two batteries at once at yeah. two amp. Yeah, me too. And, um, I, and four batteries at one amp and six batteries at 0 0.5. So, nah. The only thing I can't charge at two amp is my triple batteries. But if I get the in life battery charger, which is Goesa, um, you can do three batteries at two amp. Ah, okay. So I'm saying we're going for that. It's it's still three batteries on two amp. It's not a lot on huh? three batteries at once. <laughs> no, but it's better than two. Or when I charge them, I have to put it to an amp. Yeah, okay. Three is better than two. That's right. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I always charge uh, eight. Nay, no, ten batteries mm. uh, at at once. So, <sighs> and I let them charge at night. So I don't care. <laughs> I've got my battery charger there. My old. X star. Don't know if you see that. It goes yeah. up to one amp, and I don't use it. 
It says here, but it doesn't get used. Got it's only one amp charge. Nah, I, 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 tell, I tell you, but I always uh, charge at night, so I don't care. <laughs> and okay, it's not safe, but mm, if <laughs> if if you see my man cave, nothing is safe here. Everything <clears throat> everything in my man cave works at one uh, <laughs> at one contact. So <laughs> I never charge at night. If I'm charging and I'm going out anywhere, I take the batteries out of the charger. Uh, uh, yeah, and then put them back in. I'll come back in. Yeah, that's safer. But mm, I'm not. Yes. A, I'm not a, a safe person. <clears throat> <laughs> I am. Yeah, uh, I know. You get people that leave their 3D printers running all night. I wouldn't. Mm. <laughs> you're, to be here. you're a safe person. You're a organized person, and I'm just the opposite. <laughs> I wouldn't say organized. If you look at my desk at the back of me. Yeah, but I, 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 I can't show you the, my desk here because you'll think it's a dump. <laughs> if you see That's my man, man, if you see my man cave, and the floor on my man cave, it's a dump. <laughs> um, yeah, my full room's a dump. I've got a walkway from the door to my desk. <laughs> That's only about six queer. Okay. Yeah, same with me. Uh, Something like that, something like that. <laughs> and if I if I look around, huh, I'm always a little bit uh, scared to let people in here. <laughs> it's the first thing I say if they come in, don't watch the clutter. <laughs> nah, it's nah, a real never let them down here. Uh, I've, I, I had meetings here, so now it's a little more a problem because in in the beginning. My table was in the middle and you can sit around in the hall of the cave and you can sit here with 14 people. But now with my setup for my camera and everything in this corner, uh, there's not a lot of place anymore to get a lot of people in here. <laughs> <laughs> the meeting's go gonna be smaller next time. Um, <laughs> we know, Gimme. Yeah, Ronnie, you know how, how, how it looks like. <laughs> <laughs> John, I've always charged my batteries at 2 amp and I've had 2 years out of my batteries so I don't think it does actually that much damage to them Yeah, they always say it does damage but nah You are, you're proving the opposite so <laughs> Yes <laughs> mm, um, oh, I can't stop vaping <laughs> I can't see anything anymore here and I and I even got I even got a wait ah, take it take it take it I'm gonna put it a little bit higher I even got a an avatar here but even with that it doesn't work enough to get all my vapor uh. <laughs> no I don't make the room that cloudy I think the vents above the wind is open <laughs> ah, that makes too much noise. You, uh, with the avatar you really have to blow your vapor straight into it and then it maybe takes up huh, a quarter of it so <laughs> that's mm. not that good then no that's not that good if you want in a room like this and you want it to work you maybe have five or six from those things and then it's gonna make a lot of noise because one already makes a lot of noise L listen I'm gonna blow some vapor in it Beside my oh, beside my mic. Can you hear? Yeah. Yeah. It's like when you're cooking <laughs> above it's your stove. Defeat, you're defeating the purpose here because you've got that on the floor. Yeah, I've got but it. But it should be up higher so it catches your vapor. Yeah, vapor falls down, huh? <laughs> but it goes up first. <laughs> yeah, that's true. And it's real misty here already, so... <laughs> yeah. We're all more opposite. And nah. If I put a, a window open, there's too much uh, background noise. Because uh, it's too busy on the street here. I, I live in the center, so... I can't open my window. I'm not too bad in this room, because this is at the back of the house. Where the main road's at the front. I know, my window is... There's heroin traffic down the back. 
My What's window that is on in? the front, and uh, especially in the weekend, it's pretty crowded. Now I'm I'm stri I'm uh, right behind the the how do you say it the shopping street from a uh, heist and the high street. Yeah, the high yeah the high street and uh, with all the with all the shops and everything and all the 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 bars to go out and there's a whole square here with a lot of bars. So every Friday night, Saturday and Sunday, there's a lot of noise on the streets with uh, <laughs> yeah, wasted people, <laughs> especially Saturday mm. night. Well, I stay on the main street, which is the main road in and out of the villages. Mm. Um, there's what, three roads in and out, just, That's it. and I'm on one of them. Okay. <laughs> nah. um, like I've got shops, chip shop. Chinkies, car wash. Yeah. Did have a pub to the shut down. <laughs> well, Means I'm, I've got further to walk now. <clears throat> I'm 50 meters away from all the pubs in uh, here, so and uh, every uh, it's Friday and Saturday uh, there are two or three discos here also. So every weekend it's party, and at the moment in the in the in the high street here there's a something to do I don't know what because the street is closed off and a lot of people on the street so at the moment there's a lot of noise outside so I can't put any window open because <laughs> you won't hear me anymore <laughs> mm, the only noise I get the dogs next door barking when they're out uh, yeah I don't have dogs anymore <laughs> only have a cat and she I've got five uh, okay I always, no. uh, since I was uh, living on my own, I al always had a dog, and but since I I moved in with my new wife, she didn't like it and uh, don't have a dog anymore now. Now we have a cat and she doesn't like me. <laughs> <laughs> I've only got one cat that doesn't like me, mm. the but he doesn't like any of the other cats neither. <laughs> okay. <laughs> now, my cat only likes me late at night when my two <coughs> wife, when my wife and my daughter are in bed and sleeping. Then the cat will come to me and she will, she will ask me to uh, rub her back and everything. So <laughs> then she comes, uh, she comes to me when the when my girls are awake. Nah, nah, I'm not important. <laughs> <laughs> nah, nothing special. Yeah. And did you uh, get any answer from anyone who you sent anything to come into the show already? Um, a few. Yeah. But they're saying Sundays are hard. Yeah. <laughs> <clears throat> like I asked um, Vaymi Vivek, obviously his vlog goes up on a Sunday. So yeah. he spends Sunday recording that. Ah, yeah. So, yeah. Yeah. Just have to wait and see what happens. See if we can get a month for half an hour or something. Uh, I, I still have to get a, a new answer from Grim Green. He, he wants to come on, but we still have to organize it. So I have to. But every time you send him a mail, you get an automatic answer, and a few days later he answers the mail. So it always takes a few days <laughs> <laughs> to chat with him. <laughs> um, I've sent mails to everybody for the UK vape show. Yeah. Vic's the only one who's got back to me. Um, I asked Mark from Nature of it. Yeah. He says that Sunday's hard for him. <laughs> um, I've still got loads more to ask. Cause you said you asked Jules, didn't you? I, I'm, I will ask her. Yeah. I, 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 I didn't. Yeah, but I didn't send any mails this weekend because with my sons and it was a, a, a little hectic weekend, so I couldn't do anything. Yesterday I really didn't do anything. I wasn't even. I didn't came up to my cave yesterday, so, uh, and I only work in my cave. <laughs> I there's still loads of other reviewers to try. Yeah. Um, <clears throat> got GBV Nation, um, Little Bros Vape, MF Vape, yeah. might make reviews. <laughs> <laughs> okay. There was just loads of them still to try. I'm gonna ask uh, Zork or something, the South African uh, reviewer. I also asked him to uh, review my 
RDA, so I send. Um, I have to send him a message. Uh, how's uh, what was the name? Because did I put it on? No, no, Zork or something. I didn't put it on here. <laughs> oh man, I'm such a mess. <laughs> 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 I don't know if Joe's is still in chat. No, I don't think so. I don't know. Yeah. Are you still there, Jules? <laughs> no. Yeah, her name's coming up. Yeah, okay. Maybe we can ask her now. <laughs> yes. <laughs> if she wants That's to come on the show. <laughs> if she wants to come on the show one day. <laughs> 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 Why not? If she's here, why can't we ask? <laughs> but maybe I was, that's why. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Even just getting castles. Haldenburg, look. There's a few of them as well. Yeah? Um, like Simon for Coyley Tool. He's a caster. Oh. Yeah. Um, yeah, there's loads of people who just do casting. They don't review, they just do live shows. Okay, yeah, me too at the moment. <laughs> yeah. But that's gonna change. Uh, Heldenberg, look. Oh, Lou, look. I'm thinking that Jules isn't here anymore. No, I don't think so. That there's no answer. No. Ah, uh, well, I will send her a message. No problem. I'm, I'm going to try to do it tomorrow if it isn't too busy in the shop. From the, the free, m the, the quiet moments in the shop, I will try to do it. But I also have to order a lot of stuff tomorrow, so I'm going to see when I have time. Uh, nothing to order or nothing. I've got everything I need. Yeah, I've got a lot of order um, for the shop, not for me. <laughs> <laughs> I may wait until the start of next month before I get my last item in for expo. For yeah. review. So that'll probably be my next purchase. Anything vapor related. Because uh, I've got enough juice, I've got enough stuff to do my reviews to expo as I've said um, no, that's the thing I never purchase anything so I, I, I hope nothing. they're gonna send me something <laughs> before <laughs> <laughs> or something new comes into the shop and I and my busted I can take it <laughs> normally I don't yeah if I nice. buy if I buy something vape related my wife kills me <laughs> <laughs> see I'd prefer to buy stuff because then it's stuff that I want to try. Yeah, uh, I understand. But f there are stuff that I take from the shop that I really want to to try out. But I, I, yeah, I tell you, if I buy stuff, my wife really kills me. <laughs> so she always says, "You have enough. You don't have to buy new stuff." So that's why you say it's something that a company sent in to you when it arrives. Oh, I never paid for that. Uh -huh. <laughs> yeah, she ain't stupid, you know. <laughs> but then you have to have a separate account, bank account for paying out. I have a separate purchase stuff. I have a separate bank account, but it's always empty. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Simon from Coy is a gentleman, so the Mark from Nature yeah. is some of the nicest in the vapors. Both of them are two ga good yeah. guys. That's something you should try and get to stock your RDA, is Mark for Nature Vape. Ah, but, yeah. Do you have his email address or anything? Um, yeah, it should be on his website. Oh, okay. Uh, I'll look it up. I'm going to write it down, because... <laughs> Yeah. Um, I forgot like uh, this is not that paper I need, it's the other one. It's on yeah, it's one. just info at naturevape.co.uk. Okay. Nature vape. 
nature vape mark juice mama vape I've sent it in a messenger for you yeah uh, oh in a VC yes yeah I will uh, I'm always scared to open something new eh? <laughs> <laughs> oh, I'm not saying open it just now no I'm not gonna open it because I'm always scared that something goes wrong <laughs> Now this goes open. No, no, no. Okay, leave it like it is, cause <laughs> I'm scared it will crash. I, I, I don't even, uh, I don't even want to change any screens anymore into the live, cause I had, a, <laughs> I had a close up ready, but I'm not gonna open it. <laughs> right, John's asking, um, Demi, do you think I should give the profile a miss or purchase it? Uh, yeah, it's difficult for me to say because I'm not a really mesh fan. But if Jim says Jim likes the tank, so if you wick it right, it, it isn't bad one. But yeah, I'm, I tell you, I'm not really a fan of mesh into an RTA or an RDA or something. So I can't say it's bad, but uh, it's not my thing. So. I'm still thinking what I'm going to say with the review and what I'm going to say about it because I can't be too <laughs> bad about it. But can you still stick a normal coil on it? Uh, I think so. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You can still put a normal coil in it, but it's not meant to be. So I don't. The problem is the juice holes are pretty are pretty big to put your cotton in the, the wicking holes so if you put a normal coil in it I don't think you have enough cotton to fill the wicking ports but you should be able to dual coil it yeah but even then if you see how much cotton comes out of it to from the mesh coil I don't know if it's going to wick well I have to try it now if my tank is empty I'm gonna put a new coil in it and I'm gonna see what it's what happens and I think I'm going to review it not the week coming but the week afterwards because I want to test it properly Pro properly oh man <laughs> <laughs> I, fo I fell over my tongue <laughs> yeah tongue tied yeah hey Chris yeah and also the problem in Belgium is if I want to sell my RDA, I really I first have to register it it at the at the at the FOD, and then it, it normally takes six months before I can sell it in Belgium. Ugh. Yeah, so I don't know how we're going to do it. How we going to sell it in Belgium? And it it, it would be uh, how idiot it would be if. I bring out an RD, RDA and I can't sell it in my own country. <laughs> yeah, you should have had the form and ages ago so yeah. you can sell it. Yeah, I know, but first uh, mm. the thing has to be there before you can uh, register it. Oh. And, and that's with everything in Belgium, so that's a problem now in Belgium. If you want, they see something on a review from Mike Fape or any uh, anybody and the day after they're in the shop, hey, do you have it? But mm. before Belgian Wholesale have it, has it, it's the, uh, it takes six months. <laughs> so <laughs> it's already old then. Yeah, it's old and passed on to yeah. something different. Yep, and that's a problem in Belgium. You've John has the R has the profile RDA, but he doesn't tried it yet. If I got yeah, it something not new, not tried that mesh. No, if I got something new, it's the first thing I try. <laughs> well, I think John actually won it off of me. Okay, uh, something else to say. Oh. Damn, I forgot to, 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 to put on two sweaters again. It's starting to get cold again. Huh. 
And here's me sweating. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, but it, it was uh, almost snowing a few, uh, an hour or two ago here. No, nah, we had the snow yesterday. Yeah. Scorching sun, sunshine on Friday, snow Saturday, <laughs> sunshine today. Yeah, today, it, it all was in one day today. Uh, when I went to the shop at, at 10 this morning, it was sunny. When it was uh, 12, uh, 12 o'clock, it was uh, almost snow. It was like hailing, or how do you say it? Hail? Uh, yeah. Yeah. Then it went sunny again, and when I uh, went uh, to to uh, to put my uh, to bring my son uh, again to uh, to his mother, it starts snowing. So <laughs> we had everything today. Oh, so you're about like over here then. Mm -hmm. We usually have sun, rain, sweet, snow, <laughs> everything in one day. Yeah, well, Belgium is like that too. <laughs> okay, the Scottish weather is probably even worse, but... <laughs> yeah, mm -hmm. just a bit. Get down and register it now. Yeah, I can't register it until it uh, comes out, so that's a problem. They have to see <laughs> the final results. And they have to see the box where it comes in, and they have to see the the manual, and everything has to be okay to uh, sell it in Belgium. The manual has to be in three languages, in uh, the three Belgian languages: German, French, and Dutch. And there has to be a warning on it from nicotine. There has to be a, a sticker on it from which uh, wholesales it sell. Um, there has to be a sticker on it that it contains nicotine and that it's dangerous for children. The sticker has to be on both sides of the box. So, nah. <laughs> they're really making it difficult in Belgium to sell vape stuff. But see the warning saying it has to have, um, there has got nicotine in it. It doesn't. Yeah, I know. It's false advertisement. Yeah, I know. And it has to be it's in three, and in Belgium it has to be in three languages also <laughs> um, yeah. you should actually put on it um, what's it may contain nicotine if added yeah some because some you do have people that don't uh, vape with nicotine yeah I know but yeah that's uh, but in Belgium it's the same as uh, smoking eh? everything mm -hmm. vaping is totally the same as smoking eh? it's on the same page you can't vape in a in a bar you can't vape in the shop, uh, you can't vape in your car. It's all forbidden. <laughs> so, if I got my son in the car and I vape, and the police sees it, I have to pay a thousand euro. <laughs> they just want to make money. You can make your day though. Eh? You kick the kid outside and vape. Yeah, I know. But if I'm driving, <laughs> I'm always vaping when I'm driving. So now I'm start. I'm I'm, I'm starting to look at it that I don't vape when my son is in, when my kids are in the car. But uh, it's a hassle. <laughs> yeah. Nah. So we don't have that problem over here. Nah, I know. I wish uh, our rules were the same as in a uh, in the UK. <laughs> you are. Can you see that happening? In, in the UK, <laughs> uh, the government is promoting va vaping. <laughs> And in Belgium, they're uh, they're trying to stop it. So, yeah, big difference between countries, eh? Yeah. Even though we're all in Europe. Yeah, even in Europe. Now Germany is e is also a little bit tighter, and uh, and e it's even worse in Canada. In Canada, the, it's almost forbidden in some places. Or in Thailand, you can't even vape in Thailand, or you you get uh, stuck into uh, into jail. There was a Belgian girl yeah. who vaped at a at her uh, at her motorcycle in Thailand. She was having a, a drive with the motorcycle and she was vaping on it, and they put her in jail for eight days. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, in the local shopping center, you can't vape, but there's a vape yeah. store. Yeah, we can't vape into the vape store. <laughs> <laughs> That's a crazy thing. Yeah, 
Yeah, the profile is all, all about mm. how you wick it. That's why they say you have to cut your wicks when they come out at 40 degrees and then just put the, the bottom s s uh, the bottom uh, piece of your cotton. The s the, the s it's just a small piece then that you put into the wicking holes and then it would wick better, they say. It's talking about the RDA. Uh, yeah? Not the, pro not the RTA, the, the RDA. Ah, uh, uh, the RTA, uh, okay. With the RTA, it's... Uh, that doesn't even matter. But even with the RDA, it's all about how you wick it, eh? how 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 it touches uh, your mesh. If you don't touch your mesh everywhere, it will get a uh, hot um, hot burn some of some places, and uh, yeah. you get dry hits. Yeah, Ronnie, why why don't the nicotine warning warning on? Yeah, on everything there is a nicotine warning on every device. Hey, the Kevin. Oh, people are uh, dropping in. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> you know, you're yeah, already twelve. I think mine is dying off though. Oh, I know mine. They're already yeah. twelve watching now, and I'm I've still got eight. Yeah, and I'm still dying. I'm I'm a little bit dying off now. So, <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I'm gonna get a message in a few minutes uh, that uh, my daughter is going to bed <laughs> in five minutes. <laughs> <laughs> Don't have that hassle. Mm -hmm. I have that. <laughs> <laughs> so, any questions for any of us? Put it in chat. I should maybe get Nightbot to say that. Eh? Yeah. Set up to do it automatically. And no, I still didn't, haven't uh, put on night, but <laughs> it's it's yeah, my laptop. It's too much for my laptop, and it's too much for my PC at the moment. So, but night, but you don't have to have it open to run. Oh. Once you've got it set up, it does it automatically. Oh, okay. Yeah. I have to look at it in the week then. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I didn't do a lot this week. <laughs> oh, Damn cold again. Yeah, it, I think it's getting cold here because of all the vapor. It's it's getting uh, a little bit wet and then it's getting, getting cold here. I think that's the problem <laughs> with my man cave. Because every time I've got a live show, after an hour, an hour and a half, it's getting cold. <laughs> and uh, and if I don't have a live show and I don't vape as much, it doesn't get as cold here. So I think it's just because it's too wet. Yeah, I think you need a better heating system in your house. Yeah, okay. <laughs> there, there's a good heating system here, but it it doesn't have it doesn't have gas at the moment. So <laughs> yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah, Benny already tried my RDA. He says RDA from Dimmy is great. Uh -huh. He already tried <laughs> it. <laughs> Thanks, Benny. <laughs> I just can't wait. I gotta hold it and try it. Yeah, yeah. I, I'm still waiting on all the the samples, so I can send them out. I already sent messages to everybody, but I don't have uh, the samples yet. Normally, it would come this week in a. I didn't have them, so... <laughs> yep. Just I make sure mine's is stainless steel. Yeah. <laughs> okay, I was, I'll make sure that it will stainless. I, I'm, I'm, I'm looking out for the black one. I want to see the black one. It's, I want the black one. I'd wait to see it too, but they're not very good for doing reviews on. Nah, yeah. Nah. Well, for, I think it's better for me for reviews because on the on the stainless, my lights all, all always uh, reflect. So I, I I rather have a black one. It doesn't reflect that much from my lights. Yeah, but then you've got the problem of sometimes you can't see airflows or anything like that, eh? or the wee details. Sometimes you can't pick up. Yeah, okay, yeah, that's true. But with my with my yellow black background. It's pretty okay. Uh, yeah, see, I use black background. Yeah, then it's a problem. 
especially in the close-ups. It's a great map turned upside down. Yeah, I tried it, but it, it doesn't focus. My camera doesn't focus right on black. I don't know why, because because I tried it Strange. on the yeah I tried it on the back of my uh, belt mats and everything. It it doesn't focus right, so I don't know why. <laughs> <laughs> and I'm not just a technical guy to <laughs> to to change the settings and everything. So yeah. still have to learn mm. a lot. I'm just doing th just doing what, <laughs> and <laughs> just doing and see how it goes. That's what I do. Yeah. I set it up, get everything going. Yeah, but you're more technical than me, I think. <laughs> no, I'm not. Last week when I done a review. I ran out of space on my SD card <laughs> <laughs> halfway through a review. That's, um, a, that's a problem. <laughs> yes, I did. One of my camera batteries died on me. I'm glad it was one for the side shot when I'm doing the build. <laughs> because I'd passed that section when it died on me. <laughs> I was like, oh no, what else can go wrong? Yeah, always got the same problem. Now I'm doing the review through XSplit and I have to run my Canon all the time, so I have to change my battery twice while I'm doing my review. <laughs> so, yeah, so in the last review I, I even had a commercial for the vape show. <laughs> Sorry, <laughs> going to commercial now, screen of our vape show, changing the battery, Putting the screen all right again, and then all right, we go on. <laughs> so, I oh, he was doing a commercial on my vlogs, or if I'm live. No, no, I'm, I'm doing it on my on my uh, reviews now. Um, not on my lives. You oh, you won't see it because you're not on my chat, are you? Eh, have you got my? Yeah, I've got. Wait, oh wait, need to go this way. Uh, no, it's not open. Wait, I'm gonna open it. Oh, uh -huh. oh no, 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 that's the wrong one. It's mine. Hey. <laughs> Damn. <laughs> yeah, you have to open up my YouTube page. Yeah, I had, but oh, now I've got it again. It's it's trying to open. <laughs> <laughs> Problem with uh, problem is my <laughs> my laptop can't run the two YouTubes at once, <laughs> the, the, ah. two, the two screens at once. So uh, problem. <laughs> well, if you've ever seen any my latest vlogs, you yeah. know so I put a commercial in every so often. Yeah, from Coily. Yes. Yeah, I saw it. <laughs> <laughs> uh huh. Uh. Um. But I can put that in any time I want. Just a press the one button. Yeah, I could do it also in the, the X split. I also got some one. I've got ten screens in X split. Ten scenes in X split. So I've got a uh, enough place to put some screens in it. But I'm always scared to <laughs> to go to another screen. So it, 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 maybe it crashes. <laughs> Oh, I've got what one, two, three, four, five, six. I've only got seven scenes. Uh, no, I'm at, uh, on OBS. But for me, it's all in the same. It's my intro for my vape reviews. It's a FaceTime for my reviews. It's a close-up for my reviews. It's my warning screen. It's uh, my second webcam. It's the outro. It's a crazy vape show intro. It's our FaceTime now. <laughs> it's a. Uh, my logo and it's another scene that isn't <coughs> filled in at the moment but I don't know where it's there. Well, I've got my vlog screen that I show before I start going live. I've got the live screen for the vlog. I've got the coil ad. Yeah. I've got a first week one if I've got a first week for that week. Um, I just put the video into that one. I've got the logo for the show. I've got this screen for how we are at the moment, uh -huh. and I've got another one for when we have a guest on. Okay, yeah, the, the guest one I still have to install. 
and that's it. Um, if I want to change stuff, so like add a camera, yeah, depends where it is. I'll just hide it somewhere because I can do it so I can hide stuff within the scene. Okay. <laughs> just put it into the source and then hide it. And then I want I can make it visible and hide the rest. Okay. No, I've got everything in a def separate screens and blah blah. <laughs> <laughs> blah too much. <sighs> yeah. Yeah. Yeah, it's uh, which mesh do you like the best grain mesh or the Watofu mesh? The offer mesh or the what? I'm now using the offer mesh. That's the they provide the offer mesh with a new profile RTA. I don't know if it's better or not. <laughs> I, I only got one, so I'm not. I'm not sure. I'm, I think I'm going to try also the profile with the Watofu mesh, and then see what's the best. But uh, at the moment, I'm not sure what's best. I'm not sure. Uh, like Chrome, so the only mesh that I've got is the one that comes with the RFG2 and one RDA. Uh, it, is it the offer? Orf or something? Orf? No. <laughs> no. Okay. no. RFG vape. Oh. It is. Uh, there's the RDA. I can't even see it. That one. Oh. Yeah, I've also got a Kuluk clue or something <laughs> like the, the, But that's a strain, it's with the mesh uh, standing up and with the, the cotton in a vertical position and uh, that's a pretty bad RDA <laughs> Then you're no. more drinking your juice than vaping your juice <gasps> um, There's the mesh Also small holes Yeah <coughs> but it comes in the kit. Oh yeah, yeah, the big kit, yeah. <coughs> right, all your different coils and everything as well. Yeah. Yeah, the Watofa mesh isn't bad now, Jim, really. But, yeah, still mesh. <laughs> yep, don't like it. Bead eater. I only like I actually I only like the triple mesh coil from Freemax. This is the only one I really like. That's a really good mesh coil, I think. So is the mesh for the Crown Four Cut. I, I didn't try it yet. The no. mesh coil. No, it, 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 I can't find it in any wholesale in Belgium. <sighs> I got mines from Fastec. It came. Is it this week or last week? It was one of the two. Yeah. Oh, it had to be this week because it came with the Manto S. Okay. Yeah, the, uh, I, I, I tried the Crown 4, I have the Crown 4, but I didn't use it a lot actually. I used it before the review, I think. If I reviewed it, I don't know it anymore <laughs> actually. I <laughs> <laughs> uh, have to look at it. Same as the Skr tank. I still have the skirt tank to review, but yeah, I'm not a, such a huge fan either. So I have to test it with some other cause. The skirt tank cause, mm, not a big fan of it. So I'm gonna try the GT cores in it. Maybe it's be they say it's better than so. I'm gonna try the mesh GT core into the skirt tank, but uh, with I never got that. Uh, well, I've got it from the shop, but. With the uh, with the cause from the skirt tank itself, it has a lot of airflow and it doesn't give any taste. It doesn't give any taste. It's a big cloud, <laughs> but that's it. <laughs> and I'm and I'm yeah. not and I'm not vaping for the cloud, so. Yeah, it's all about flavor. Yeah, I think so. Too. In the beginning, I loved the big clouds, but nah, the longer I vape, the more people. Uh, get uh, annoyed with all the big clouds <laughs> so <laughs> I started <laughs> vaping a lot more pot systems and small devices and mount along because now like now in my Orion 
I am vaping this one CBD lemon haze mm. Sabada. CBD yeah lem oh, Sabada. Sabada. <laughs> Sabada. No, we say CBD <laughs> yeah so do we but on yeah. YouTube you say Sabada Sabada okay Sabada yes. lemon haze <laughs> <laughs> and it's, uh, it tastes good the lemon haze the OJ Kush is also good, but the lemon haze, mm, it's got a really nice flavor to it. And it's like, yeah, like vaping a, a real spliff. <laughs> mm, I've sort of tried CBD. I've not tried it yet. I may try and get some on my Expo just to try it. Yeah, uh, uh, I, I vape it almost daily now. And I don't take any uh, painkillers anymore, so it really helps me. Yeah. Uh, before I took 450 milligrams of tramadol of a, a real heavy painkiller and now I don't take anything anymore so I think it helps <laughs> maybe it's in my head maybe it's in my head uh, chat's been awfully quiet yeah. on both ears Oh, with you, uh, Graham and uh, John are talking. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> and mine is, uh, yeah, went down. Dead. <laughs> yeah. Huh? But Any like, questions? It's like me, I'm always dead too, so. <laughs> I feel dead, <laughs> cold and dead, so. <laughs> and I didn't have a message from uh, downstairs. Strange. <laughs> oh. No, I didn't have a message. Strange. It's not nine o'clock yet, though. Hmm. It's not nine o'clock yet. It's not been what? Nine o'clock. Nine. Uh, it's it's what twenty twenty. Uh, it's forty past <laughs> nine. <laughs> Come on. <laughs> yeah, yeah, your end. Yeah. <laughs> I'm talking so, about my end. We're almost two hours in the show. <laughs> yeah, twenty minutes. Well, yeah. we'll go over by ten since. He had problems again. Yeah, but not a lot eh, this time. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, John, that's right. When you're an experienced vapor, it's all about the flavor. When you're starting to vape as a young kid, it's all about the clouds. <laughs> if you, if, if some yeah. sick, in Belgium, you can buy vapes from 16 years old, eh? and. If you're six, the, the, the kids from 16 who came in, come into shop, the first thing they ask, I want a big cloud. <laughs> That's the first thing they all ask. What gives the big kids clouds? <laughs> uh, so I, I think it's wrong. You can buy it at 16, but mm, Belgian law. <laughs> they want to stop vaping. They really putting a lot of rules against vaping and everything but they still sell it at 16 I don't understand even cigarettes you can buy at 16 so I think that's wrong <laughs> yeah crazy Belgian government <laughs> yeah just like yours uh, nothing about the health all about the money <sighs> Are you cold? Yeah, I'm really cold now. Yeah. Jump up and down for 10 minutes then, <laughs> so we can laugh at you. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> yeah, right. Oh, my ears. Mm, put in my ear again. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's my headphone, huh? A small headphone. <laughs> it's the best yeah, I've got. got yeah, big ones on the I can't. noise cans one. <laughs> no, I don't like that. I, I always want to hear what's around me, so I don't even put two ears in. I just put one ear in. I want to know what's happening around me. Yeah. And I don't like a headphone like yours, all around my ears and all on my head, and my head my head is in the way and everything. So no, no, <laughs> <laughs> just a ear plug. Mm -hmm. Yeah, Patrick with Pudelbrigger. Yeah, it's all about the money. 
Uh, single core RDAs. Mm. For single core RDA, I still think the the recurve is one of the best. <coughs> At the moment, single coil RTA is a bombus for me. RTA, the bombus is also a good one. Huh? Yeah. Yes. It gives it gives a lot of flavor. Yep. I really liked it too, and I like the drip tip. It's nice on your lips. <laughs> yeah, it's not like the gear. Is it the gear? Yeah, the drip tip. It's it's it goes from small to a little bit wider from the bombus, and I like it when you put it in your mouth. I can't even find my gear. I think it is a gear that's got the same bit. It's not so tall at the top. Yeah. So your lips touch the, the bit that goes down yeah. in the top of the RTA. I can't find that for some reason. Wait a sec. I'm going to fetch something. I can't hear you for a second. I can't find my gear RTS. It's about somewhere. But where I don't know. Because I don't think I put it away. No, I haven't, because the box is still empty. Yeah. It's here somewhere. I'm back. Damn, I thought I had something to warm me up a bit, but not in here. <laughs> <sighs> but yeah. See, you should keep a spare jumper up there. Yeah, I know. <laughs> Normally I've got one, but not at the moment, it seems. Uh, the holiday, the so. Uh, didn't try it. The Etienne and the holiday, I didn't try them both. So, I don't know. <laughs> yeah. I don't know what to say anymore, so. <laughs> no. I was hoping they would have some questions. Yeah. But we haven't had very many. No. It's not like us to. So if you do have any questions, pop it in the chat. Ew. Any of the chats. And I know there's a delay between us and them here, isn't it? Yeah. <coughs> now John, I didn't like the gear um, drip tip. It's just too small. I would have preferred it if it was a wee bit bigger like the Bombus. If it's bigger up the top here. But that's just my personal take on it. Yeah, mine too. Same, same thing here. Christophe is watching us on TV. <laughs> <laughs> that's I've on, done that. That's on the big screen. <laughs> The only thing is you can't get the chat on the TV so you have to use your phone for the chat. Oh yeah. yeah. Take a whiskey. <laughs> uh -huh. Uh -huh. Don't have al any alcohol here either now. Next time I bring my Porto again. <laughs> I'll give you vodka or apple sours. Yeah, but I can't get there. <laughs> <laughs> if you can send it through the, to the computer, okay. but. <laughs> Um, I've never had the Pixie Graham. Or um, I don't think I have. Me neither. Oh, wait, right. the Pixie, the Pixie. Pixie, Pixie. The Pixie, uh Is that a single core? Um, no, in Graham, yes, it will be. Because the Pixie. 
isn't that the one looking like uh, the pixie RTA. I've got the Pixie RTA and that's the one looking like um, um, the, 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 the cartoon figure. Uh, uh, how they call the yellow <laughs> man? No, oh, how they call? Yellow man. SpongeBob SquarePants. No, no, no. Sp not SpongeBob. <laughs> not SpongeBob. Uh, oh, where is he? Where is he? Where is he? Nah, John, you should hear your dinner before you come and watch the show. Uh, yeah, but my closet's so full. If I, if I look for something in the closet, uh, it always takes a while. Uh, don't, don't yeah, when you're live and you're looking for something, you can't see it. Yeah, as soon as you stop recording live, <laughs> turn around and it's there right in front of you. It's like, oh, no. How could I not see that? Is it like Banana Man, according to AFC? Yeah, I know Banana Man, but no, it's not. Uh, no, oh, uh, Jim uh, saying it's for uh, Fry. It's from uh, Despicable Me, the, f the movie Despicable Me, the yellow people, uh, the small yellow people. From the Minion. The Minion, yeah. The pixie mm. RTA looks mm. like a Minion. But I can't find it. <laughs> huh? I know I've got it, but I, oh, maybe on them. Ah, oh, here it is. Here it is. Ah, oh, did you find it? Did you? Yeah. You also got it in yellow. I've got the black one, but with the two eyes here. <laughs> it's a minion. <laughs> and it, especially the yellow one looks like a minion. <laughs> uh, uh, I found it. <laughs> <laughs> hmm. Yeah, single coil, maybe eight fly. Uh. Yeah, Pixie is from. Uh, I think it's from Fate Fly. Because <sighs> yeah, it's, it's leaking all over, all over the place. So <laughs> when you store things in your cupboard, you're supposed to empty them. Yeah, I know. Oh no, it's from Ample. Yeah, the Pixie, but it's not Pixie, but Pixie with an uh, with a with a Y. Uh, with a how you call it in English? Wire? Why is it? Yeah, it's a Y. <laughs> ah, so it's a totally different. Yeah, totally one. different one. Yeah. I'll wait you off then, John, since you were working. <laughs> <laughs> you just have to set up um, type via speech. Or type speech, something like that. So you can just speak and it types for you. <laughs> <laughs> Down a bit. Yeah, again. Uh, almost two hours, so. Yeah. Well, I've been live for an hour and 50 minutes. Yeah. I had about 10 minutes of yeah, yeah, the logo at the start. Yeah, but when the chat falls down and we don't have anything yeah. to say anymore. <laughs> So, right. and then we can go to bed nice and early. <laughs> what time you have to get up? Five? No, I'm still in the sick. Uh oh, lucky you. <laughs> there you go. There's my gear. <laughs> okay, okay, it's a really short one. Huh? Yeah, it's about maybe point two, point three mile difference. Yeah. And it does make a big difference. Huh. I knew it would find it eventually. Uh. My old 
this won't, won't work any today. Say again? My O's won't work any today. <coughs> Blowing O's. Hmm. Now I still can't hear him right here. So back to the doctors on meds that find out what's happening. Yeah, that's a, a long time. Um, been about three weeks. Hey, Tom, Radio Exact International. Good evening. We're in Ovens from Holland. Come from Kevin. Netherlands. Yeah. And Kevin is going out. Bye, Kevin. Bye, Kevin. Oh, Ronnie has to has to get up at three thirty. Oh my God. Oh. <laughs> that wouldn't be me. Wouldn't be me. <laughs> <laughs> that would hurt. <laughs> I, I would rather go back to night shift and get up at that time in the morning. <laughs> nah, I know it's nothing for me. Oh, message? Nah, not the wife. All right. <laughs> well, you've not even got your phone on silent. That's terrible. What? Don't have the phone in silent. Nah. Yes. Nah. <laughs> Why? Because I want to hear when somebody sends a message. <laughs> That's terrible. Yeah, I know. I am terrible, you know. <laughs> The gear is fantastic for flavor. If I find it, I will try yeah. it. Yeah, it's actually pretty good. If I if I come around it, I will try it. <laughs> if you're at the expo, bring it with me so you can go show it. Okay. <laughs> if I go to the expo. Yeah. <sighs> yeah. I can't see me using it at the expo, but I'll take it with me for you. <laughs> Okay. It just doesn't hold enough. Nah, d d d two mil isn't enough. <laughs> it's about ten, pu ten pulls and it's it's empty, so you can b you can better take a dripper. <laughs> yeah, I think I'll have my top side with me. I don't know what dripper I'm going to put on it just yet. I always mm. take too much to Expo, so this if I go to Expo this time I also only going to take two or three mods with me, so I don't know which one. Well, I'll use one, I'll take three with me, mm, but even that's too much. Normally I've got seven or eight with me, at least, but oh, no. I only use two or three, so I'm, I'm not going to do that anymore. So, at the Expo in October I didn't have any bottom feeders with me, at all. No. Or drippers. Okay then. <laughs> <laughs> it was three tanks I had, mm -hmm. and then I had uh, my pod with me for at the hotel. I always uh, take my dripper to the expo because I want to taste all juices on the dripper. So mm. I always, always use a dripper on the expo, never a tank. Bye, well, this Jules. time I'm going to take one. Jules was still here. Bye, Jules. Ah, Jules, before you go, would you yeah. come on the show as a guest one night? I was going on the vape in Belgium with the vaping uh, laws. Not really good, Tom. <laughs> too much laws and <laughs> too much restrictions. Mm, bye, Benny. Bye, Pache. People are getting out of the show already now, so... Yeah, it's because it's coming up to 9 o'clock, my yeah. time, 10 o'clock, yours. Yeah. I'm taking the Jules' away. Yeah, I think so too. Yeah, I sent... Oh, oh no, there's Jules. Sure, sure thing, babe. Okay, Jules, I'll send you a message One else will contact you. <laughs> yeah, we'll contact you to uh, arrange it. All right. I send you a, I'll probably send you a message tomorrow. I'm going to try it. Three mil with a bubble. It's with a bubble glass. Three mil. It's not enough. <laughs> yeah, that's the gear. Yeah, it's not enough. Night, Jules. And anybody else that's just disappeared. You. Uh, and I think I'm. 
quietly going to wrap it up also in a few minutes so I can hey go. guys last shout out for questions from you yeah. if you have any before we call it yep. then I can sit with the wife for a half an hour or so she's happy <laughs> Have to score points. <laughs> I need the points. <laughs> well, why it's held down? Probably because they're swearing on it. Shit. Yeah, shit. You mean in Holland they're also busy with. Oh, in Holland they're trying to ban uh, aroma to make your own juice. <laughs> they want to ban it. So you can't <laughs> even make your own juice anymore. And they already got only 10 mil bottles. So, it's gonna be nice. <laughs> yeah. yeah, I thought that's gonna be pretty hard to ban yeah, I making your own. Because yeah. PG, VG, you can get for medical purposes. Nicotine would be the only thing that they could stop that would be hard for you to get. Yeah. But if you've got enough of it, then you're fine. Because the flavouring is just food flavouring. Yeah, it's for, for food also, so. How can they ban? Yeah, so you can flavors? get it for bacon. Yeah. <coughs> so, hmm. Yeah, strange. Hey, yeah, John, when I go to the expo, I don't go anywhere near any of the juice stalls. <laughs> I stay away from them. Uh, plants like in the US. In the US, they also want to ban everything. Yeah, I know. Yeah. Idiot country. <laughs> <laughs> At this time last year, I was in the U.S. in U in a uh, in a uh, New York at the expo. This weekend. Hmm. Yeah, that was on this weekend, wasn't it? Yeah, I was there last year. The the one I went to the 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 one I went to with last year, he sent me the pictures today. Oh, this was last year. Yeah, thanks, <laughs> thanks for reminding me. <laughs> Yeah. It was really snowy then in New York. <laughs> really <laughs> snowy. And it was nice, all Central Park in white. It was nice to see. <laughs> oh, oh boy. Need to get brownie points. Yeah, need to get real good points. I've been a bad boy, so I need to score points. <laughs> <laughs> mm hmm. Starting with changing my phone number today. <laughs> uh. Yeah, mixing your own saves you money as well. If you if you make it yourself, it saves a lot of money. Yeah. Well, one of these bottles, which is 50 ml, you add your next shot, next shot gives you 60 ml. Okay. For yeah. about 15 pound. 15 pound, that's the same as in Belgium. In Belgium it's around 20 euro, 20, 25 euro, some are 19, some are, I've even got uh, for 13 euro 50 ml in the, in the shop from mm. Mr. Wick. <coughs> I can buy my frozen pond concentrate, same size 60 ml for the same price yeah. and it'll make up 400 more juice okay no we only we only got uh, the aroma for 30 mils in the shop from vampire and from fizzy and everything and then capella uh, 10 mil bottles and tpa 10 mil bottles to mix up uh but it, it, it bye it's, jim it, it's it's you know jim it's it's a big difference because I always say in the shop if you buy one liter of juice prefab juice you're around 500 euro if you if you make one liter of DIY juice it's around 250 euros it's half of the price so it's it's, no, it's, it's more than half the price because I can make up a 10 ml bottle of juice and it will cost me I think it's about 16 17 pence for to make. Much? 10 mil. 10 Is mil? It? Yeah. Hmm. I don't know what one screen this will go to. Um, 
and are didn't they, go with that are, one. Are they trying to uh, are they trying to ban shake and vape in the UK? No. No, I, I don't know. think so. Because Tom just said that he, he heard uh, they uh, tried to ban shake and vape also in the UK. Oh no, <coughs> it's eighteen pence per mil. Eighteen pence per mil. So oh. it'd be like one pound eighty for mm. ten mil. That's yeah, one pound yeah. So that it's the same price as Miller's, <laughs> the cheapest juice. <laughs> Tomorrow a new high-end mat. I'm I'm curious about that. Jim's review. Yeah, we can get Jim on. Yeah, but he doesn't want to get on with his face. <laughs> mm. Nah, he doesn't want that. His, his review is also only a close-up. Huh? It, uh, it never comes uh -huh. on to his with his face. I, oh, he, he was here when I had a live vlog. Uh, he didn't want to come on it. So, <laughs> <laughs> nah. It's going to be a difficult one. <laughs> um, AFC, there's plenty of places selling the nicotine. You can still actually buy it in the 72 milligram per milliliter. No, in Belgium only 20 milligram is the max. Ah, oh, but you make up a fake company so you can get it. Mm, yeah. Yeah, that's uh, in Belgium. All that's the same with salt nicks. If you want to make your own salt nick, the the highest you can go is twenty mil, uh, twenty milligrams. So I don't. Uh, it's only only twenty milligrams they sell in shops, and it's not high enough for me actually. So I yeah. or, I ordered from a friend in Canada. I ordered three bottles of fifty milligrams, but still on its way. I mean, I had to make up my own neck shots for the King's Cusser stuff. So I made up a 10 mil, 18 milligram. Uh, oh. So when I put in it, that's it down to three. Tom hear, heard about it from a, a Dutch uh, advocate that uh, they want they wanted to ban uh, the the 50, the shaking vapes in uh, the UK. Hmm. I've never heard nothing about that. Me neither. Strange. Yeah, AFC. You can mix the juice first and then add the nicotine shot. Yeah. Yeah, you can do that. Yeah. Just make sure that you take off. Well, it depends what next shot you get. If you get 100% PG or VG or whatever mixture it is that you take that off your yeah. PG and VG, or you include that in when you're doing the calculations mm. on whatever site you're using yeah, yeah. that you'll make it we uh, I weaker than what it should be <laughs> okay I'm gonna slowly wrap it up because 10 past yeah. 10 time to go downstairs a little bit cleaning up here and then downstairs and I can I can sit a half an hour with the wife all right everybody for me I'm gonna make it tonight uh, it's a big mess the vape community around the world yep it's a big mess that's true <laughs> <laughs> because it doesn't bring up a lot of money <laughs> to the to the governments that's the biggest problem okay that's it for me today good night Yeti slap well good night everybody Mark thanks to everybody that's come in yep. um, and chatted to us and chatted to each other and you've kept the chat going fairly consistent throughout the full show which is good um, if you haven't subscribed to me or Dimmy yet, please go and do so. Um, I know I mind you'll find the link down below, it's also on my chat. I don't know about Dimmy's site, but I've never checked his. Nah. <laughs> so you need to put both your links in your description. 
so that they can subscribe to each other. Yeah, and still need to fill in the description of the show, so that's yes. afterwards. I'm going to do that. Um, and if you subscribe to both, they're saying you can go and get both charts up at the same time while you're watching the program. <laughs> Why what me and Demi's got, <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> and probably some others, since there is a few people post in both charts. Yeah, and if you um, do, and if you get uh, subscribed, you can have a chance for some uh, giveaways sometimes. <laughs> well, if you if you're subscribed to me, I do have a 750 sub giveaway running at the moment. Yeah, I know. I think I've subscribed. I'm not sure, but I think I subscribed. <laughs> yeah, you are, because you're a wee hammer on my chat. Ah, uh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> um, but yeah, hit's running at the moment. If you want details about it, go and watch my last vlog, which I can't remember the number. I think it was 76. Yeah, I think so too. Um, and you'll find out all the details there, how to enter, etc. Because there is some rules to it. All right. Um, but thanks again for coming along tonight, especially the first show on a Sunday. Now yeah. we'll be staying on the Sunday for the foreseeable future, at least. Um, so remember, stay safe, and we'll catch you next week, same time, same place. All right. Bye. Bye. Have you ended? Mm, not yet. My PC doesn't want to end it yet. <laughs> I'm trying now and they still can't hear me because <laughs> my exploit is crashing. <laughs> no. Yeah, but... Solving the problem now. <laughs> <laughs>